everyone, welcome back. I'm about to give you the ultimate tour of the Grand Magic Hotel. It's incredible. I'll be showing you the lobby area, a room tour. I'll be taking you down for breakfast. And I'll also be showing you where you can go and have a nice little cheeky drink too. I really loved the theming of this hotel. It was really immersive. The themes changed throughout the day and you'll see what I mean when I show you the other clips in a minute, but stay tuned because this is a really good hotel and it's only eight minutes away from Disney and it also offers free parking. Hi everyone. So we just got down to the reception area in the hotel. Honestly, it's absolutely gorgeous. The walls have got like twinkle lights in them. And then can you see behind me? You can actually see that all the female, all of these move as well. So you might see a little butterfly in a minute, but when you come back in like the nighttime, it'll all have changed to clouds. So it feels like really homely, really cozy. And just grab a drink from the bar and come and chill. This is beautiful. I actually do feel like I'm in some kind of fairy tale. I love it. Moving on to what is probably my favorite part of this hotel. This is the lobby area. Now, as you can see, they've gone for that country vibes. You've got all the trees, you've got the nature, the butterflies. Now these are all 3D screens, so it really did add a really good feel and effect to it. And I can't emphasize enough how great this area smelt. I thought it smelt like cotton. Lauren thought it smelt like vanilla, but both of those smells are really nice smells. Throughout your stay, you'll see that this area actually changes theming. You have the countryside theming, the under the sea, the space theme in and at night time you have that nighttime cloud feeling which was my personal favorite but you're going to absolutely love this area now this adorable area was actually the bar now don't be deceived by the size of it it was only a little bar but they had plenty of offerings grab a seat and enjoy a cheeky drink Morning everyone. Morning. Morning. Hope you're all all right. Didn't pop it in yesterday because we we're really tired, but I'm going to pop it in now. We did a room tour. We did mm. actually end up with a family room. So we've vlogged this hotel before, before the renovation, but we'll actually put in the room tour now. Right, so I'm going to do a little room tour for you guys. So we're staying in room 2519. Hopefully Lauren will let us in. We come Welcome in to my crib. Welcome to your crib. So this time I have done a tour on the when it was the magic circus, but we've actually got a family room. So I thought I would show you guys the difference between with the normal rooms, you just get like a standard bed, um, a standard double bed. And with the family rooms, you get the bunk beds as well included. So let me just give it a little rotate round. And that's what it would look like if you had the bunk beds. There's a single on the bottom and a single on the top. Smells amazing, it smells really clean in here, doesn't it? It does. It looks new as well. It does look new. Looks like a really, really good room. As we've said before, the rooms are brilliant. The only thing that's questionable is the size of the pillows, but I'm sure you could request for some more because it's only half a pillow. So if you're here for a number of days, just request for some more. The beds are perfectly adequate. Everything's very clean, which is the most important thing. This is the wardrobe, so you get, what, six coat hangers, is it, Lauren? Yep, that's right. Yep, what's in the bottom one? So you've got a fridge and a safe. Oh, that's really good, because I, did, I didn't know we had a fridge. That's really handy, because we brought a couple yeah. of bottles of pop with us, haven't yeah, we? That's true. And I also, I also noticed in the hallway as well, there was um, an ice there machine, was. which there is was. really handy. So not only have you got the fridge, in the hallway, there's an ice machine as well, mm. and the safe. So that's really, really handy. And then you've got looks like a kettle that's um, great because another fact if you don't if you've <laughs> never stayed in the disney hotels especially when i stayed in the sequoia one with annie she had to bring her own kettle they don't supply kettles so if you're staying in the disney partner hotels they give you a free kettle and then they come and top these up daily what's that strawberry and raspberry flavor red berries okay. full english english breakfast your milk Sugar. sugar and then just some coffee. This is a coffee, maybe? Co uh, cafe? Maybe it's coffee, I'm not sure. <laughs> you get a bit of summit, summit. Yeah. You've got a desk area. You've got a desk area if you're coming for work Cute purposes as well, lights. or if you just want to do your makeup on. Yeah. And then you've got a massive mirror here. Yeah, nice and big. Lovely big mirror. TV. And also as well, even with the kids' beds, I don't know about you, I can't sleep with the light fully off. I have to have a little bit of a light. 
so they they oh, yeah. they do actually have lights under the bed for the kids and you see the wallpaper all of this lights up as well do you know what else i've noticed the kids lights they've also got usb ports that's handy on both because we all know they like to play on their tablets yeah. <laughs> we don't have usb ports but they do priorities <laughs> and it looks as though these little box designs are little storage they've got little areas. storage areas as well yeah let's have a look on the top bunk they're pretty big as well yeah definitely top and tail if you've got a couple of kids and the pillows i know you're saying they're half the size probably for an adult yeah same size for the children but because we're just two adults we can we can take to. those two pillows but if you are coming as a family you do need that bedding you need that bed and this bed, <laughs> then I'd ask for some more pillows. Plenty of like, sockets, I've noticed there's one down here, there's one on the desk area, there's two by our, by the side of our beds, so obviously you've got the USBs that we just mentioned. And it feels warm as well, they've yeah. got a temperature guide up there where you can adjust it. It's actually lovely having the heating on, because um, <laughs> I'm sure like most oh. people, um, we all restrict our heating, so it's actually wonderful being able whack it up. Whack it up. <laughs> <laughs> it's nice having a bit of heated on, especially when it's been a bit chilly in the parks today. Bathroom. Oh, look at the bathroom. Oh, this is a new added extra. It's stars. <laughs> so it's a bath shower. Yeah, bath shower, removable shower head. Which is great. Plenty of towels. Should we do the shower head test? Let's see. Yep, yeah, that's a clean shower head. Plenty yeah. of towels, sir. Plenty of towels, yep. Yeah. And with the towels as well in this hotel, if you're staying for multiple nights, as soon as you've used them, if you just leave them in the bath, what they'll do is they'll replace them for you daily. That's what we do. And what they give you? They give you hair and body gel. Hair and body gel? Is that thing? And liquid soap. <laughs> and liquid soap. Even the um, hair dry looks. Even the hair dry looks a little bit better. Do you want to give it a little try, Lauren? <laughs> Let's see if I can get this to work. And it also looks like it's um, a built in shaver as well. I think you have to hold it. Like a heat gun. I mean, it's not doing not much. much. <laughs> you could be there a while, but they supply you with one. Yeah, you don't have to pack that. It'll dry the kids' hair after they've had a bath. <laughs> they give you cups. There's a couple of cups in there as well. Yep. Yeah. Massive mirror. Yeah, massive big mirror. Very happy. Hopefully you enjoyed that little room tour and um, love this hotel really great mm. value for money We've also just been down for breakfast yeah. and got a few clips for breakfast Hopefully it all makes sense because I was trying to just avoid people so I'll throw those in as well now Now moving on to my favorite part of the tour of course it's food So this was the breakfast buffet area and as you can see it's had a little bit of a liquor paint in this area too Pan is my personal favorite Plenty of cheese and meat offerings in this section. Plenty of cereal offerings and they were changed daily. Moderate salad bar, but I mean, let's be fair, who's eating salad for breakfast? Probably not me, but if you are that person, then fill your boots in this section. This was a really nice added touch. These were freezing, um, but there was a microwave if you wanted to warm them up. And as you can see, I added plenty of Nutella to this. Mm -mm -mm. The egg was really nice, tasted like eggy in a cup as I previously said. The sausages were okay, but perfectly fine for free. And then we had breakfast with a view. I mean, it's not every day you can say you can have a free breakfast with that view. It was really nice. We went back for pancakes, panchakalas, Lauren had some bread rolls. Top tip, get a mug to fill your apple juice because the glasses are very small. Then I went up for some bacon, some sausages and lots of ketchup and yeah, we really enjoyed coming to this hotel. So breakfast was really great value for money and the reason why I say great value for money because it was absolutely free. <laughs> 
cost nothing and with some of the other Disney partner hotels you only get free continental you get free hot and continental it's Breakfast, excellent yeah. really good I had like the bacon I had the pan chocolates with the Nutella mm -hmm. you had the bread rolls and the Nutella crepes oh you had the crepes yeah. and the crepes were slightly cold but there is a microwave as well yeah so if you do want to heat them up go and heat them up and the microwave is really handy to know because if you need to heat up any of the baby's bottles or anything yeah. like that while you're staying that's another added little extra so guys moving over to the fitness area now if you're someone like my dad that loves going to the gym on your holiday then you'll be pleased to know that this is included in your accommodation price it's only a tiny gym but it's more than adequate and the equipment looked really good to be fair now you won't catch me in here but if you like a bit of fitness then you'll love this little area as you can see this is the children's pool and then over to the left hand side there was an adult's pool this is split off which i really like because there's no risk of those little ones jumping into the slightly deeper water so they have fully blocked that off as you can see from this clip really liked it it was really clean i loved that there was a little splash area as well and a little tiny slide for the kids the lounge as well, that's where you found lots of the parents and the temperature in this area was great, it was lovely and warm and a perfect place to chill. Grab yourself a magazine and have a little relax. Now I hope you enjoyed the little tour. Thanks for watching, I hope you found this video useful. See you again soon guys, bye!